So there is a new bug within the game I feel everyone should know about. It's a bug I've been hearing about for a long while now, actually from way before the Lays patches too. But it seems as though it's still here and although it isn't as bad as the inventory white bug, it can be just as frustrating. Today we check out this bug, I actually showcase you guys footage of it and we also have an update on the damage mitigation bug too. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more Outriders on a daily basis be sure to subscribe. Firstly let me apologise if I sound tired, it's because I am, I've not long come home from the gym and I'm absolutely shattered. But I thought you guys should be updated with the latest news surrounding the game so here we are. Ok so for weeks now I've seen reports and people mention to me that they have had loot disappear from their inventories. I even had a pal claim he had a legendary that turned into a rare item. I've also seen people mention loot dropping in level to a point of it somehow being reverted to the item it was before it was leveled up. Now seeing reports like these you always question them because you don't know if that said person reporting the issue is mistaken somehow or I don't know first the wrong button or something you just don't know. But the other day I was healed by a guy on my discord and he mentioned the fact that he somehow had loot disappear but he actually recorded it happening and it's absolutely weird people. So we first put this clip on reddit and well to be honest he was met by the many scumbags that were over there that were just dismissing what happened even though it's clear as day what went down. So the clip you are about to see the dude marks and dismantles loot he doesn't need no more for those materials. But upon doing this, it somehow also dismantles two pieces of gear he is wearing. His best real gear somehow just vanishes. Looking back at the video, the gear he is wearing isn't marked, which I don't even think he can mark gear you're wearing either. It's just like the game bugs out and deletes two pieces of the gear for absolutely no reason at all, making his character more or less naked in those areas. And this clip is recent guys, so just a word of warning, be careful out there because it does seem as though when dismantling loot that you don't need, it's quite clear there is a bug where it will also delete equip gear too. Now thanks to the kid for bringing this footage to my attention, as it just proves it's not all perfect yet, in regards to what's going down. It is a truly difficult situation and I kind of feel sorry for people can fly as most videos we are seeing now are negative ones and they just can't seem to catch a break. But bugs like these are quite easily ironed out and I feel it will get sorted before you know it. But again guys, just a word of warning. Although these instances seem pretty rare, they are still happening. If anything like this has happened to you, let me know down below in that comments section. Ok so guys we also have an update on the damage mitigation issues people are still having, me included. So they tweeted that out earlier with a link to reddit which states the following, latest update the 10th of May 2021. Testing for the patch to resolve the damage mitigation not working properly throughout this week. Until testing has been completed, we will be unable to provide a precise release date for the patch in case the testing indicates that further work is required. Important, we have identified that the issue regarding enemies doing excessively more damage all of a sudden is most commonly, but perhaps not exclusively, triggered by the specific steps below. Join a multiplayer session as a client, leave the multiplayer session. Additional trigger, as either a host or a client attempt an expedition on a lower challenge tier level, for example, playing on a challenge tier 12 with a level 50 character. The issue will become more prevalent the greater the disparity between your armour and the enemy's level. In such cases, the game code encounters a bug that prevents it from pulling an important back end stat table. If you tend to hop between multiplayer sessions with different partners, you may therefore be more likely to encounter this issue. Staying with the same partners for the duration of your play session or playing solo should help mitigate against this issue occurring. Restarting the game fully should force the game to once more pull the correct stat table which in turn should prevent enemies from dealing more than intended damage until the bug reoccurs. We are additionally looking at what we can do to short term mitigate particularly against one shot kills from certain enemies such as the brood mothers. However, as such changes will affect everyone rather than just those who have encountered the issue, we need to be careful here. If we go down this route, these changes may be a potential holdover until the patch releases, but we will share more news around this when we can. And that is it guys.
So yes, an update on the damage mitigation, or as I like to call it, migration, as you know. But yeah, an update on the damage mitigation bug. A super annoying bug a lot of people are experiencing. And I hope this gets resolved soon too. But yes, guys, that's been the news for the past few days on Outriders. If you enjoyed the video, leaving a like it really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Outriders on a daily basis, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. And hopefully I will see you on that next one.